Hey guys, it's TMF Style. I'm Jose Zuniga, and for this week, I want to review a new pair of denim that I recently found. So school's about to start back up. You know, you guys are about to go back into college, high school if you're in high school, and you're gonna need some essentials. I've done a video on essentials before on college essentials, what I have below, but I think in this video, I just wanted to focus on one, and I think this is probably the most important that you'll need, and that's a good pair of denim. And if you've been watching my YouTube channel for quite often now, you know the problem that I have with denim. You know, finding a good pair of jeans is probably the most difficult thing you'll ever do in menswear because the fits are so awkward up until this new brand that I found. So today I'm going to be reviewing RPM West. I had heard of RPM West before about a year or two ago when they actually recently launched, but I had never tried any of their products, but I always have been curious. They've always been quite successful on Kickstarter. I believe they've done two Kickstarters and they've raised, I think, over 100,000 both times. So they've been really successful, which is a good indicator of their quality. So I wanted to try RPM West and I was very pleased by their whole layout in sight. You know, they have their basic jeans and what I really enjoyed about RPM West is their size guide. For jeans, it's very, very hard for me and I've given you tips before that when you're going to buy jeans, it's almost always a negative to buy them online. You always want to go to a store to try them out because of the hard fit. However, RPM West has a very good detailed size guide where they show you all the sizes. So they give you the waist size, they give you how big it is in the thighs and they tell you where to measure. So for the thighs, you measure one inch below your crotch. Then they give you the knee size and tell you where to measure as well. And they give you the ankle size. They give you, every, and obviously the, the inseam length. So they give you all these sizes so you can measure at home and that way you'll know if the jeans will fit a little too tight or either too loose, which I think is perfect. Another great feature that they have is they have a little tailoring or almost custom shop where when you buy the jeans, you can pay an extra $15 to either, you know, let's say you, you know, the, the 30s fit a little too tight from the thighs from the measurement guide and you need to move up to 31. However, the waist will be too big, you can pay an extra $15 and they'll actually taper the waist in for you to your required or specified size. They actually do this with the hem, which I, I really like it. However, it didn't work for me. I asked for the 32 and it didn't come in that way. I don't know, maybe there was a, some sort of miscommunication. I really like the concept. I kind of, you know, on the downside, I kind of really hate that it didn't come out that way because I won't be able to review it for you guys and see just how effective it was. So I never really got the, you know, because I asked for two inches less, I didn't get it. However, I think it's a really cool concept and something no other jean company is doing. And it's something that I really like because it really gives you that custom feel to jeans. So now you have jeans that actually fit without actually having to go to the tailor. Of course, it'll cost you $15 more. So I really like these things of RPM West and I wanted to show you the pair that I actually got and show you the versatility. So for the first look, what I, ha what I am wearing is basically you dressing up denim. This is the best you'll do. You always, when you're dressing up denim, don't think you'll be going into a boardroom meeting with this, but you can dress it up in a very sophisticated look. You always want to keep it in the casual realm and maybe throw on a, a playful blazer like I'm wearing right now. If you're going to dress it up, you're going to want to tie, top it off with some dress shoes, belt and a good pocket square. All this will give you the highest level of dress for some jeans. And for the second look, it's I dressed it down. As you see, I took the tie off, no pocket square this time, still kept the fun blazer because like, this is essential for a more fun look. And then I went with a linen pullover, which I think is great for summer. It's very cool, very breezy, and it, it's something a little cooler than a regular button down. And finally, I paired it off with some slip-on sneakers. So this is the final look, this is a more casual look and this is not as dressed down as I would take it or maybe just without a jacket, I just threw on a, a simple bomber, very lightweight, it's, it's like a seersucker, very lightweight rain jacket almost, but it's in a bomber style, so it's very cool, especially for summer, it's really not warm at all. And I just threw on a striped t-shirt underneath and some casual leather white sneaker. So that's it for this week guys, this is, you know, I think a, a, a pair of dark denim is essential for anybody's wardrobe, especially if you're in your younger, you know, in your youth, you're going to college and all that, you're going to need a good pair, especially one that fits. If you want to try out this new startup called RPM West, I definitely recommend it. Their quality is great and they fit perfectly. So check them out. I'll have the link below. Thank you guys for watching.